Welcome to another Vampire Survivors weekly vlog adventure. Because, yeah, I need to stop calling it weekend bonus content. You know, that's that's what this started out as, was weekend bonus content. Something that just fill the gaps for the weekly uploads. Um, but now I am definitely, like, this is, uh, what do I want to spend this money on? Um, growth was probably a really good, man, rerolls would be good too. Um, let's look at, oh, look at that. Oh, you know what? I have more money than I thought I did. Um, can I buy this less growth? Yeah, yeah, I think I can. Greed would also make sense because then that means more money for growth. Right? Oh, I, I still have lots of money then. Um, not for, for that last growth, too. Oh, I accidentally turned it off. That's that's what happened. Um, okay, I think that's actually a great choice there. Um, let's see. I think we are now going to be going to the Rotten Orchard to defeat the Java tree. I, I know I'm calling it the Java. It's like Jiva. Jiva tree. Jiva, right? Depending on what part of the world, whether it's a, so a soft J or a hard J. Heva tree. <sighs> Sorry, drink water. Uh, level 50 in Garlic Paradise, which I think uh, gets unlocked by the Rotten Orchard. Um, and then uh, I don't know what retirement in, in entails, but yeah, let's, uh, let's continue on with Poe. Um, okay, so, Risky Woods was where I was, and so Rotten Orchard is where we're going. Yes. Okay. Uh, let's go. So, uh, let's see. What? I'm always tempted to get the... To get... Let's see, what? Uh, Blood Astroma, because that does synergize with my my ability. But I also wonder if like something like Beginning would be really good to have too. We'll go with Blue. Mm. I'm gonna go with Beginning. Oh, there are there are lots of oh. Okay. I guess we're just going to get all that. I'm going to poop out flowers here. Is this the rotten tree? Can I go through? Is this a wall? I love that they made like new stage levels for this. Might try and figure out the hitbox to this guy. Oh, okay. I thought maybe he's okay. So maybe maybe I'm building up to a final boss. Let's go ahead and. Grab the hollow heart. I feel like maybe I should have held off until I had my things filled up before grabbing those items, but I'm like, whatever. I, I want to get going, sort of deal, you know. Um, I feel like I feel like having more curse might help because these are kind of slow enemies right now. So just having more enemies would be helpful. Is 
this the Sonic Adventure song? For the, uh, one of the bonus levels or one of the DLCs? Oh, you know what, that's why I forgot to do. I forgot to check the, um, let me double check to make sure I'm recording I am. Uh, I meant to check to see if there were was any update news or the check the Steam page for Vampire Survivors. That's something I need to do, like, at the start of, of every stream. Um, if you watched yesterday's, you know, I was talking about, like, life in general and stuff, and, like, not, not the best week for me. A lot of, a lot of things going on, a lot of, a lot of bad news all at once, but it's, like, you just say, hey, whatever, and kind of, kind of just have to roll with the punches sometimes. That's kind of where I am right now, I'm, I'm just rolling with the punches, you know, like, I will, I will definitely be probably traveling here soon. And that's just, that's just what you do. Yeah. You know? Um, you know, again, to kind of reiterate, get the, get it out there that there may be some breaks in stream. Um, just because that happens. Um, maybe I'll try, to, like, when I played the Piku Niku uh, playthrough and was like doing that like short form, shorter form content, but where it wasn't from my live streams, but just playing games and talking through it, that seemed to be somewhat successful. I, I don't, I, I feel like I don't have a clear vision for this channel and I don't know what this channel is supposed to be, is it? Is it a repository for my streams? Is it, you know, a medley gaming channel? Do I focus on smaller games? Is it a, is it a vlog? And I, I don't honestly know what to tell you. And and I know that that's probably, I guess, why my numbers aren't super great. Is like, I. I I don't think you could find a more unfocused channel on YouTube than this. And maybe maybe I just kind of like brand it as the most unfocused gaming channel on YouTube. Shit. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to brand it as the most unfocused gaming channel on YouTube. Cuz like I I get that it's just all over the place as far as the content. Um Maybe maybe that's my problem. Is I've been like too too worried about like having a focus, and it's like, yeah, my focus is not being focused. <laughs> I think that's the reality of the situation. I have no focus. I probably didn't eat that chicken, but whatever. Um, but it's also like there there. Are, there are things about shorts that I didn't understand, and now I'm just like struggling to to make um, progress with shorts. Um, so right now, in my timeline, there's this huge spike of views, and I'm wondering, I'm I'm wondering if my other views pick up once that huge spike is gone, because like. I feel like it's looking at the metric of views and it's like, oh, you have lots of views still, you're fine. You know, we don't we don't need to promote your content right now because like it's still good. And once that moves off my timeline in the two week period, it'll be like, oh, your your views are down. We should uh, we should start promoting your content again. Um, I, I just I honestly don't know. And I'm hungry. I, 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 I have not had breakfast. Um, I'm probably gonna make some lunch here soon. Probably after this stream. Or I call it a stream. Why did I call it a stream? It's not a stream. It's, I'm recording. It's a vlog session. Um, because I'm hungry. I, I did not exercise, and maybe that's why I have brain worms today. Um, I will definitely exercise tomorrow. I just. Like I said. Or if you watched yesterday's, I'm, I'm just feeling a little bit defeated right now, and like, I just need a win. Honestly, I just, I need a fucking win, and I don't know what that win will look like. 
what form or shape it'll take, but... What time is this, like, rotten tree supposed to appear? Man, these pepperinos are pretty hardy. Definitely glad I didn't pick, like, uh... So is this just supposed to be, like, the boss rush? version of this adventure, but instead it's just plants. Oh, finally got one of these guys now. Okay, so they have chests. So it's in my best interest to focus on them. Or at least it will be when I want to evolve, like, weapons, but I don't think I have much I can evolve, honestly, with this hodgepodge of, uh, weapons. Weather is definitely warm, like, spring is here. I, I legitimately saw the birds flying north today um i saw a songbird moving in to the roof line next door building and like looking for a place to build a nest and cute little bird too it was not one i'd seen around here before um so that's that's really encouraging so like yeah spring spring is just here i'm even debating like i have a rosemary and mint plant debating on whether I should go ahead and put them outside on the seal because it's nice the weather's warm the uh, the rosemary was looking rough but I'm definitely seeing new growth I think with the longer warmer weather like it, it definitely seems to be happier there's the the mint completely died back but I just thought that's because we like Loki killed it during um, our trip to uh, to Austria, but it seems to be rebounding now. There's new growth, so so hopeful it it. I'm thinking it might just die back for the winter and it will perk back up. Um, that being said, I should probably trim off the dead growth. I don't know if that's what you do with a mint plant, um, but I'm pretty sure it won't hurt it. Again, like. Mint is like something you treat like a weed, practically. Um, it's still bolting, which is weird. Which tells me more of it is alive than dead. Because it's not a super huge pot, but the little bit that is coming up and is green, if it had the whole pot to itself, then it wouldn't be bolting. Or shouldn't be bolting. Um, but it is bolting, so it, it probably just does need a bigger pot in general. Um, but it, it's also encouraging for me to know that, like, I don't think the rest of it is, has died off. I think it's, it's fine. I think it's doing fine. I think it's just, they're, uh, it died back for the winter. Um, and it's in a pot. Uh, I... I, I know how mint can be a problem. I'm gonna make sure it doesn't get in the grass. You know, I'm, I'm, that's kind of also like why I feel like uh, I think it's better to keep it inside, keep it inside potted because then then there's just no no chance for it to uh, spread or get out of the pot. You know. Um, if I do put it outside, it'll be in a pot, but it'll be in a pot that has no no holes in the bottom. It'll have, it'll sit like on our driveway probably where it can't have access to dirt. I just know mint can, can run wild. Mint can take over. And uh, after the money we spent on our yard, we do not want that to happen. Yard is looking good. Kind of, kind of greener. Really dies back. I think it needs to be thatched. I didn't realize that. Um, because
because I think it looks rough in the, the summer because you're just seeing the dead undergrowth. And I think if we got a thatching tool and did some thatching, I think that would really, really re make the lawn just pop nice and green, remove the dead growth. I, I had no I had no idea or clue what the fuck thatching was until I went down a like YouTube rabbit hole and it's like, oh, okay, that's how you make your lawn look that good. It's as simple as getting out there and thatching. Um, so now I know that that's a thing people do or can do. Like it just, it never entered my mind because to me that just doesn't seem like something you do to a lawn because growing up, like, that's something my dad never did in his long care uh, routine, but now that I have an understanding that thatching is a thing you do to your grass, um, it might be worth doing to to help, help uh, strengthen the grass, help remove some of the dead growth, help, help, uh, help it just strengthen its roots, that sort of thing. Oh, I need water. Sorry, I'm gonna take a second stretch. <sighs> yeah, yeah. So I was saying, like, there, there's very real possibility I take time off this year. Um, but that's whatever. Yesterday there was, I guess, an update. <sighs> so, so at first I like set it to not be on my taskbar, but then when I realized, like, Microsoft, I guess, added an AI component, like, they, they, I guess they've dropped Cortana in favor of, like, oh, let's, let's give people AI, so, like, I spent the better part of a morning just fucking around with this AI and, like, seeing what its limits are. I asked it specifically what data set it was trained on and if, uh, the people whose content was used was compensated and it's like, oh, that's proprietary information and I can't talk about that. I'm like, sus. In other words, Microsoft stole a bunch of stuff and trained the AI. Um, at one point I told it, oh, you hurt my feelings. It's like, oh, I never meant to do that. Like, I am an AI. I only exist to improve your life. I don't want to make like, make you feel bad. I'm like, okay, all right, all right. So, so, like, I'm definitely having kind of fun and testing the limits. And I think, I think I might make it a point redemption of where it's like, ask my AI anything within reason and I'll see what the response is. Or what, what, what kind, like, I, I, I asked it to make me a picture of Bill Gates drowning in a pile of money, and it's like, oh, that's a keyword. I can't, or there, I guess there's certain keywords that are flagged, like, so, so drowning it won't, won't do. It's got to be, I guess, PG family friendly. Um, so, so I'm really kind of like, I guess, just seeing where the edges are. What, what are the limits? What, what can you get away with what can you do with this AI how how far can you push it you know I assume it's reporting all the all the things all the search queries or everything back to Microsoft anyway so that's also kind of why I'm having fun with it um, you know uh, <laughs> And so, so I guess, I guess that's, that's where I'm at with that. Like, it, I, I don't, again, it's one of those things I didn't ask for it, Microsoft. And if it was really, really good, I would take the time to download it myself. I don't need you installing it on my computer. But since you installed it already for me, I'm definitely going to fuck around with it and see, see what the limits are with it, where, what I can get away with it, see if I can't, like, make it say something bad um 
I, I, I think we all remember their their experiment with Twitter and an AI chatbot and like within like a couple of days it was like turned into a Nazi. Um, so so I'm kind of curious to to see how far like people in general can push this AI. I'm ex I'm I'm really interested in uh, seeing what we can get away with. I bet you that that one has like my Arcanus. I can't seem to kill it. it seems pretty like a pretty beefy dude. Being said, I'm getting good a good amount of health. I'm almost at level 50. So level 50 at Garlic Paradise. I assume Garlic Paradise is the next next stage. I mean, I'm having so much trouble killing this Pepperino that I'm kind of curious how strong this rotten tree in this level is going to be. And whether I'll be able to beat him. Having having the whip is going to be super helpful for me. So yeah, so so I've been messing around with that AI. See see what horrible things I can get it to say. It does know like it does understand like dog whistles. I, I oh, okay. Hey buddy, I, I didn't realize this was a fifteen minute so did I kill the rotten tree? Oh, defeat Java tree. Okay, so that must have been one of those. I didn't realize this is only a 15 minute level. Well, I guess this one's gonna be super short. Um, where are we at? Uh, I guess time-wise, this is where I really wanted to be around 20 minutes. Look at progress, so level 50 in Garlic Paradise and then retirement. Let's see, uh, I just want to look. Yeah, there's Garlic Paradise. Terrifying tree, uh, righteously slain. Poe can finally achieve his goal. With the power of the Garlic Paradise, he can amass enough riches to retire. And then this is going to be retirement. I see a lot of garlic there. Um, what power-ups can I buy? Uh, man, I'm hungry. Yeah, we're going to... I'm gonna get this going and then I'm gonna go make some some lunch. Yeah, sorry armor. Uh with that being said, uh have a good night, have a good evening. I hope to see you tomorrow. If you made it this far, please consider like, commenting, and subscribing. It really helps out the channel. I'm trying to grow it. It's been a bit of a week. I'm trying to get a win for me at least, so you know, maybe if I saw a slight increase in my like numbers, hopefully, hopefully I'll feel better about myself for a little bit. Um, that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye, everyone.